Hello everyone, welcome back to my next tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to model this Geneva wheel in using Siemens NX. While modeling this component, start with the material addition features, then do the material remove features. This is a simple component. First, I am going to create a circle with a radius of 4 inches. After creating the circle with a radius of 4 inches, then I will model this slot, the dimensions they have given. After modeling this, I will create this arc. Then by using a circular pattern, I will pattern it, then remove the unwanted edges. Then I will extrude up to the length of 0.5 mm, 0.5 inches. Then I will model this feature. After modeling this component in the Siemens NX, the component will look like this. This is the model. The same model we are going to recreate in, in this software. These are the steps I have followed to model this component. In this learning tutorial, we are going to learn step by step in this software. First go to the file, new. Here the units are in inches. Go to the inches, model, provide the part name. Provide the location. Just save OK. Now we have opened the NX software. To easy modeling, I am just going to open this file left side and software in the right side. Now we can see the dimensions parallelly. First we will start with this, this one. Go to the sketch. I am going to take the front plane, just say ok. Then start with the circle with a radius of 4 inches. Take the circle, place it at the center origin with a radius of 4. Just put it like this here itself. Here we just want to specify the diameter. The diameter is 8. Just say no. Now we have created the circle. Then we will create this slot. This slot has to be placed here. Start with the rectangle. Start somewhere from here. And place it to here. Now specify the dimension. From the bottom to the center the location is 2.25. So this line to this line distance is 2.25. Press enter, press the roller to confirm. Then this width has to be de defined. The width is here the radius they have given. The radius is 0 0.38. The width is the diameter. Just click it here. Double click here. 0 0.38 plus 0 0.38. Just enter it. Say no. Press the roller to confirm. And this has to be symmetric to this axis. Just zoom it. Click this one. Click this point and click this point, click this axis, just apply. Now it becomes symmetry. Then we just want to create an arc with a radius of 0 0.38. Here you can see the arc. There are two options, three point arc and cent center with two point arc. I am just taking a center with two point arcs. This point, this point and this point. Press the roller to confirm. Now use the trim to delete the unwanted segments. Trim. Trim this one and this one. Again trim this one. Just close it. Now we just want to define the uh, this feature. This arc. Here you can see this arc is 4.5 from the the center is located 4.5 inches and the radius is 1.5. Just take the uh, circle. Just put a circle somewhere here. Press the roller to confirm. Now the radius will specify it. Here it comes diameter. So diameter is 1.5 plus 1.5. Press enter. Say no. And uh, by 
by taking your cursor to the press the roller to confirm taking cursor to the edge of the circle you will get the center point the center point to the axis the distance is 4.5 press the roller to confirm again press the roller to confirm now we just want to do patterns before that just remove the unwanted edges here just remove this one remove this one press the roller to confirm first we will pattern this feature just select this sketches now here there is option called pattern just click this pattern we have selected the curve here we are going to do with a circular pattern choose the circular pattern select this one we need to choose the center point this is the center point then count and pitch it and asking count and span total span angle is 360 degree and total count is 1 2 3 4 5 6 make it this twist 6 now you see it came just apply now we just want to do one more pattern this curve select this curve specify the point same center point and uh, 360 degree total is 6 just ok now we have created all the features now just remove the unwanted edges go to trim just remove this one close just control is it yes this one is correct now select this only the one this sketch pattern circular pattern specify the point is this point 360 degree just ok now remove the unwanted edges by using a trim option select this trim select this trim edges this one this one this one and this one similarly here this edge this edge this edge this edge and this edge just close now we have created the complete model just finish the sketch this is our model go to extrude the total thickness to be extruded is 0.5 inches make it symmetric value this one is 0.5 just save ok now we have created this feature then we will go for this feature for that sketch Select this one, just say OK. Here you can see the orientation is little uh, awkward. Just go here, finish the sketch, delete. Now, sketch wherever the mouse you are taking, there it will create the coordinate. Ah, yes, this one is the correct one. Actually, this is taking. We need to choose surface to the coordinate. Yes. Just say OK. Now it's coming good. Take the circle. Create the circle. Press the roller to confirm. Now the diameter has to be specified. The outer diameter is 2.5. Just click it here. This diameter is 2.5. Say no. Just press the roller to confirm. Finish the sketch. Extrude the extrusion length is 0.5 one side only just say ok Now we just want to remove this uh, uh, Keyway cut for that go to the sketch again Select the surface Just say ok Take the circle Create a circle press the roller to confirm now Now specify the uh, diameter is 
1.5 press enter say no press the roller to confirm here we just want to put one rectangle just start here put a rectangle make this symmetric just go to here this point and this point to this axis just ok now specify the dimension from this point to this axis this is 925 0 0.925 press enter press the roller to confirm now this height this height is 0 0.2 This height, this height is 0 0.2, 0 0.2, press enter, press the roller to confirm, then width, this width is 0 0.36, click it here, this width is 0 0.36, press enter, press the roller to confirm. Now we have specified the complete dimension. Now just remove the unwanted edges, just go for the trim, just trim this one and this one, just close it. Now finish the sketch, extrude, change the direction, make it to next, until next, just save it. Now we have created the keyway cut also. Then finally we just want to create a round here with a radius of 0 0.25. Now just go to the edge blend, rotate it, select this edge, the edge radius is 0 0.25, just save it. Now just go to the orient view isometric view. So this is our model. Now we have created using Siemens NX. Just rotate if any feature is missing. All the features we have created. To change the display, just go to the display, edit object display, select this object, save OK. Color, give some any color, just save OK and apply and OK. This way we can modify the color of our object. In this tutorial, we have learned how to model this Geneva wheel. In next tutorial, we will come up with a new component. If you like this video, please share to your friends. For more videos, please subscribe my channel. Thank you for watching my channel. Thank you.